Uh, Jimmy and I cleaned up the, the area up here in the house, the pool. Um, I don't know if, you, if we had this done or not last time you we were here. I don't think we did, but we put reflectors on those trees. Just put thin little strips on them. But uh, when you're uh, when you're up here at night, they light up. They'll light up just fine. You won't you won't miss them. Um, so we just we blew off the path and raked off the stuff, the debris and whatever. And um, I didn't cut this grass. I was thinking I'd wait and wait for uh, since we have Luis coming back up, taking care of stuff. I know it's just grass, but and we could probably just go and trim it. But anyway, I was just waiting on him. I don't think it's hurting anything yet. But just give me the word if you want it cut, we'll trim it up. Uh, roses are doing good. I think next week we'll probably throw that wire up. And start training them on that wire. That one's a little small. The rest are doing really well. But, um, I called Luis. A couple of the trees up top are drooping a little bit. The trees that look like that. The same ones we were looking at last time up by the barbecue. Are, uh, they look a little droopy. And those oaks up there don't look great either. So we'll see. Uh, I had Jimmy pressure wash lightly on the deck here. Only problem is the bird poop, now that it's the grapes are purple, it really makes it dark and these don't come up. I mean I sat there myself and just blasted one and it it does not go away. So I'm not sure what to use if we want to use something but like I say they we cleaned them but they just they don't go away so anyway for now um, Maria cleaned she came last Friday she came she called me the week prior and asked if she'd come on Friday instead of Monday and she did not for this Monday but for the Monday before. Anyway, she's a week ago today. She was here and she cleaned and she cleaned the bathroom and sink and stuff in here um, while she did the house. But we got everything. Uh, clean. Oh, I want to show you one thing. I want to take the pressure washer and lightly clean this cover, but I didn't want to do it right before you got here because I don't want any of this junk to get in the pool um, while you're here. If we do it a week before you come, the chlorine and the filters will get it all out. But see how there's some green stuff there. And it's just uh, stuff seems to build up close to this edge here. And then out by that tree, that tree drops a lot of junk on it. But anyway, what we'll do is we'll just move it in and just slowly pressure wash and brush and just kind of clean it off. I think we should probably keep that clean. Um, if I'd have thought about it, we could have done it a week ago. But anyway, you can't really see it too good now, but there's, as you probably already know, there's residue in here from the tree. Um, so we'll get to that. But I mean, it, it looks it looks good. It looks fine. It looks clean. But just like I say, the spots aren't going away. Um, something's, something's been digging around up here, as I told you before. And it's not as bad this week. And we cleaned it up and I think we, we know they've been in there and then there's just little holes everywhere as you can see. I'm thinking about putting a camera up here. I just wanted to let you know first and ask you about it. Um, might be a good idea just to put it right here and point it. Uh, when I say right here, I mean this tree. Or, well anyway, just point it at this hill right here. And see who's coming in here and digging in there. And then we'll have to figure out what to do about it when we find out who it is. So, anyway, the countertop, you probably saw the email I sent Mike from Concrete Countertops. Uh, it keeps doing this, 
this why I cleaned it I mean I scrubbed it just soap and water here and it just doesn't get it all I don't know if you can see it with the camera you'll see it when you get here um, I tried some cleaner and it did kind of take it off but it left a different kind of film on there or it kind of stripped off the sealer I don't know which it's just but I mean that's after just scrubbing with soap and water and this is the best I could get this and like I said I don't I can't block the Sun but you'll see it um, and then this is my screw up I set the bottle of cleaner here and it had some on the bottom and it made this mark here and I don't know I mean it's not like it was battery acid it was just household cleaner so I'm just wondering why I mean is that stuff that fragile that we can't set a bottle on top of the countertop anyway that's my mess up uh, so I'll let you look at it and I told Mike I'd get back with him and go from there Let's see everything else here. Here's the trees. That's the one that looks kind of droopy. I don't know why I'm showing you all this stuff right before you got here. Just so you have it in your mind when you come up. But um, there's a couple other things too. But anyway, uh, that's it for now. I just wanted to kind of like say touch base on those things so you could look at them. And anything else, I'll we'll talk about when you get here.